What's up mga ka-adventures and welcome to Adventure Story Yahe! Today's vlog ay i-share ko po sa inyo ang aming exercise every 3 months, ang lowering of lifeboat and rescue boat in the water. We are currently at Adelaide Anchorage, Australia and we got the permission a while ago from the VTS to exercise and to do the drill of lowering of lifeboat and rescue boat in the water. For your information mga adventures, this lifeboat is our lifesaver during emergency situation when we abandon the ship. And two ways of launching of this lifeboat is through gravity and also by David. So gamit kami ngayon ng lifeboat David mga adventures instead of by gravity. Dahil ang by gravity ay ginagamit lang ito in case of actual emergency when we abandon the ship. Another means of lifesaver mga adventures ito yung aming rescue boat that can be also used in emergency situation especially in man overboard. And on the other side, we have the life raft. That's the best option when the ship is sinking mga adventures para sa akin. Ako pala ang magbubukas ngayon sa pag-release automatically ng lifeboat through hydraulic pump device na yan. And naka-seatbelt na ako ng mga adventures and meron pang dalawang hook dyan nakakabit sa taas kaya safe na safe yan. After I open the valve and pump it 7 to 9 times as per instructions, ay magbubukas po yung release pin na yan and mag-let go na po yung lifeboat. So we are getting ready and all set. Kaya dito yung dalawang OS namin. So sila po yung lineman ngayon. And of course, through David po yung gagamitin natin sa pag-launch ng lifeboat. We have two ways to release our free for lifeboat mga adventures through automatic. Yung pinakita ko sa inyong hydraulic pump and also meron tayong manual operation when the automatic doesn't work. Nakikita nyo mga adventures, kinabit namin yung dalawang cable na yan sa dalawang hook na yan. So by David yung operation namin. So dahan-dahan po yan, baba ba Unlike po sa automatic release by gravity, ay on the spot po talagang bababa yung lifeboat na yan. Parang simpilis na kibla. Marami na rin yung insidente na nangyari mga adventures kapag by gravity yung pag-release ng lifeboat. Dahil sobrang bilis po nito. And of course, much better na gawin tong by gravity operation na to kapag nasa actual emergency situation po tayo. Because it's a do or die situation. And malapit na mababa sa tubig yung aming lifeboat. So meron tayong embarkation na other dyan dahil bababa sila mamaya dyan. When the lifeboat launched during the actual abandoned ship mga car adventures ay kompleto po sa gamit yan. Meron tayong food ration, drinking water, and survival items mga car adventures. In case we need some help, we have distress signals there. So we can survive there mga car adventures in a couple of days if weather permits. Mo, at sakay ka 30! No comment. First time, man. First time, masama kayo? Three times na. Three times na. Sana all. Literaro na pala to eh. So, kaway-kaway naman dyan. Hello! Hello! Hello, madam. So, nakababa na po yung aming lifeboat mga adventures in a few minutes ay bababa po yung mga crew dyan para i-maneuver po yung lifeboat. Pagkababa nila ay i-release nila yung hook nila na kabit sa taas and i-maneuver nila yung lifeboat paabante and paatras pero naka-stationary pa rin yung lubid niyan sa crew mga adventures. So, ayan na, nag-umpisa na silang bumaba mga car adventures para pumunta dun sa lifeboat. So, paabantihin lang nila yung lifeboat ng ilang metro, much better na mas malapit lang sa barko dahil masyadong magalaw yung tubig. So, para hindi kami mahirapan sa pag-secure and pag-recover ng lifeboat. Usually, mga adventures, kung kalma, kalma talaga yung dagat, ay papaikutin talaga yung lifeboat, paikot sa barko. But this time, masyadong magalaw, so mga ilang metro lang niya abantihin. So free for lifeboat lowering is completed so we have to recover our lifeboat and return it back 
to its stowed position mga Kart Ventures. This is my brief information mga Kart Ventures during our emergency operation in life at sea. Salamat sa inyong panonood. God bless us all. Bye!